Hey, what's up guys? It's Cliff with Peg Flamingo Power Wash. I'm back with a brand new video for you guys. Today we're working in Lando Lakes, Florida. We're here for a house wash. Uh, we're gonna do the roof cleaning here, the driveway cleaning, the pool cage cleaning. We're also gonna seal the front driveway and the pool deck. Uh, right now, the one is backing out the house wash. I had a little difficulty with my 12 volt this morning. So um, we're gonna do the house wash first. We normally do the roof first, but it is what it is. I just gotta figure it out. So he's finishing up the house now, but I wanna show you guys what we got going on. If you haven't yet, subscribe, like, leave a comment if you got any questions and hit the bell so you know when I put up on the video. So let's go check the job out. All right, so these are the pavers in the front. We're gonna clean, sand and seal these. Uh, like I said, the one is washing the house right now. The house wasn't too bad to start off with. The windows were a little dirty. Uh, looks like he downstream from the other side of the house all the way to this point here. Uh, we just gotta give it a good rinse. We all gotta be doing the pool deck and the pool cage back there as well. I had an air leak in my 12 volt, so it wasn't drawing the SH. So therefore we gotta start uh, doing the house first. He's already uh, applied the SH on this side. I've got a little overcast day today, but we'll be able to get everything done. Back here is the pool deck. Pool cage is not bad. Just a little dust and stuff on it. Cobwebs. Got cobwebs and stuff like that. But we get that cleaned up. But we will be sanding and sealing these pavers, hopefully today. I don't think there's no rain chances, it's just cloudy. Just gotta play, play with the weather sometimes. Looks like the one is finishing up uh, on downstream in the front. We just turned the flow pro on. You see it flashing, that means we're on rinse mode right now, so. He's gonna start rinsing from back there and rinsing the whole entire front. And I'm gonna jump up there. I think I'm gonna put my ladder up to this uh, entrance area right here so I can go up to the second story. The one is finishing up, uh, finishing up rinsing this side of the house. He has this one last side of rinse. I'm gonna jump up. Uh, he'll water down the plants for me as it's going around to the back. He'll do the pool cage. I'll do the uh, the driveway. He'll do the pool deck as well in the back. All right, this is the front side of the roof before you go up to the second story. I'm gonna go ahead and just spray it down now since I'm right here going up. You know, it'll be dry by the time I get back down if I need to um, touch anything up. Looks pretty dark, a lot of algae never been cleaned before. So we're gonna make it look good. All right guys, we're on top of the roof now. You can see it's pretty dark, pretty dirty. I'm gonna have to use the one software system. Mine is acting up today, so. Therefore, we gotta change it up. Appreciate that he was here with me, so I'm able to get it done. You guys can see this roof is pretty dark and pretty dirty, so we're gonna make it look good now. I won't do too much talking, I won't get sprained. Catch y'all on the recap.
Alright you guys, so we just got done doing the first coat on this roof And you guys can see now we Getting the algae off, got a few little dark spots that we got to touch up We'll hit those up before we get down Where the algae was really heavy, you can see it here A couple little other ones over here spread out But overall, the roof is coming to life It was super black up here Total transformation We'll do a second spray, which is a light coat, and then we'll come back and um, do a recap. I still have to get down to the back section, which is like right over the pool, uh, pool cage. I gotta get down and move the ladder so I can get to it. All right, we just did our little small little light coat. And uh, you guys can see now how the roof looks. Whole different color. Just to give you a snapshot, I'll walk over here and show you guys what I have to get down to do. I didn't spray this section. Obviously, that's why I walked up. See this section, how it looks. This is that section right there, how it's dark. And that section right there is clean. So we're gonna knock this section out right here and then go to the back. All right, we're in the back now. The one is finishing up the cage. This one right here is super bad. Look at how bad this roof is, y'all. I got the hose on this side, so it's easy. When we're done, we can roll it up right into the truck. <laughs> that gate don't open. <laughs> you gotta hand it to me. You gotta hand it to me right here. So I can knock this out right here. We just got done spraying the roof. Now we just have to give it his, ten, uh, his time to dwell and kill the algae. I'll do a second light little coat before we get down just to make sure that it's com uh, completely treated. Uh, we're not rinsing the roofs. We don't rinse roofs. So uh, when it rains, everything will be rinsed off and look much better. But the algae itself will die. You can just, you know, it's not gonna come out clean like tile. Tile is not porous like uh, shingles, so you're not gonna get the same effect. With tile, as soon as you spray it, you know, you're gonna see it come off because it's a hard surface. This is uh, porous, 
has granules so the uh, algae really latch on to the to the roof so like I said I'm gonna do a light coat and then um, we'll get down and uh, I'll do the driveway the one is finishing up this pool deck and the pool cage and uh, that's it we'll be wrapped up here we'll just have to let it dry come back here to finish up The driveway is cleaned up, house is washed, roof is clean, the pool deck and the pool cage is done. But this lady right here stopped me. I'll be doing her house soon as well. So, all right, y'all, we're on the way back uh, to the first job. But the weather is uh, not gonna play nice, man. It's gonna rain around five a little bit. Right now, it is two o'clock. And also, it's supposed to rain overnight all night long so we're not gonna chance it uh, like i said today is wednesday um i'm gonna reschedule the ceiling for monday so we can wrap that one up you know um i better not take the chance at all so in the meantime the one picked up another job so we're going back to Lando lakes now we're gonna knock out a driveway you know uh, as well as a uh, final fence cleaning so you know that'll wrap up the day and then uh, we can uh, resume probably tomorrow with more jobs. So uh, you guys stay tuned. We'll see you guys when we get to the job. All right, y'all, we in Lando Lakes. We're going to be doing this uh, property here, which is just the driveway. And the one is going to do the fence. The water thing is right here. The uh, customer that sent him, which owns the house, was doing some work here earlier. They turned the water off and then turn it back on so we couldn't get in the water. I got some water in my tank that I have enough to clean the driveway with, but the one won't have enough for the fence. So he's gonna turn the water on and uh, we get started. Like I said, I'm gonna be doing the driveway. I ain't gonna pre-treat. Using the Mondo with a 12 GPM. Seems like it works really well with uh, not pre-treating. I'm not sure that's gonna be the case going forward, but so far so good. I'm pretty sure sometimes I have to pre-treat because the concrete will probably be too bad. <laughs> but for now, it's working good.
All right, y'all, just got done cleaning the driveway. Uh, we are gonna post treat it. It's weird how you look at it on camera. It looks like crazy, like there's a whole bunch of lines, but in person, it really, really faint. Um, we're gonna go ahead and uh, post treat this though, just to make it look good. Get rid of the stripes. I'm glad we postponed that ceiling job. Look at all that rain coming towards us. The one is knocking out the cage. I mean, I'm uh, sorry, the fence now. I'll take you guys back there, show him, uh, show you guys what he has going on. All right, change of plans. The one needs me to rinse the fence off for him. So we'll go ahead and do that. Looks like it's already clean. You gonna hit the top of this little thing for him? This little, you gonna hit the top of this little thing? They got the green on it. That rain is coming on us real fast. I'm trying to get out of here before it start pouring down. treated the driveway looking much better walkway did the fence you guys can see it's totally dark now made it out just in time glad we didn't go seal those papers man <laughs> would have been pissed this is the fence here looking good the one to hit that little pillar for him because I'm pretty sure it'll say something extends out so clean that up too oh man what a day what a day with this weather man it's a rainy season it's good for landscaping I know that much all right guys we're back to finish this job um, Today we got good sun. Tomorrow it's supposed to be nice and sunny as well. So it's perfect time to get these papers done. We are dry sanding. Glad we didn't wet sand because it rained like crazy that day. So the one is uh helping me today. We're gonna seal the front end of and the pool deck. We got the sand laid out. We've already started up there. Um, these gonna look good. I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure they're gonna look real good. And once we're done, right now you can see how pale they look. Take note of how they look. Once we're done, we'll do a recap. You guys gonna see the aftermath. So I'm gonna get on the broom now and finish up in the one. I think once he's done, he's gonna go in the back. I'm gonna blow the front and start sealing. And um, by the time I get done, he should be done with the back and we, I can go in the back and uh, seal the back. Y'all stay tuned.
All right, you guys, the one is uh, starting on the back. We just got done doing the front. Uh, I'm gonna blow it off and then um, put the seal on it while he's doing that back there. We're gonna tape off the drains to make sure that, you know, a bunch of sand doesn't go in there. And yes, sand does get in the pool, but we're using silica, silica sand, so, you know, it's not gonna tear up the pool pump like polymeric wood. It's, in, it's impossible not to get nothing in the pool. But we just taped up the drains, put some tape over there on top of that framing. Same thing over here. Just for added protection. Less wiping. Make it easy to spray. <laughs> almost halfway and you guys can see what we're looking like so far got some good color on these pavers first coat going down right now second coat will be done to make it pop more loving it man loving it look at it look at it <laughs> got the first coat down you guys can see what the papers are looking like now we're gonna go in the back hit the back come back up here and do the second coat while these are drying complete makeover of this driveway man got nice sun out here nice weather so we can get that drying time down and then um uh, Come back and give it another coat. We're gonna go in the back now. All right, y'all, we in the back now. We're gonna go ahead and seal the coping first. And um, the one's gonna seal the deck. So what I'll do is just spray a little bit on the roller and I'll do a thin layer around and just roll the coping without having to get so close so the sealer doesn't get in the pool, all right? Coming around, you guys can see got some color on these pavers. Show you guys over there. Things popping.
time for the second coat. It's gonna be a light coat, make everything pop. We're gonna do the front and then do the back. And uh, we'll give you guys a final shot after. finish here you guys can see what the papers are looking like definitely happy with the project nice color this is the front door area always looks darker because of the shade under here I'm trying not to walk on here but I gotta knock on the door Got here about 10.30. Uh, I think it's about 12.30 now. Well, actually, 1.45, I lied. You wanna come out? You can come out. You wanna come out? Yeah, can you walk on it? Yeah, just walk this way. Yeah, it might be a little tacky. We'll be back for the back. All right, guys, this is the back here. Still drying, but you guys can see over here, got some good color over here. Looks super good over here where the sun is. Customers happy with the project. I'm happy with the project. <laughs> All right, well that's it guys. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Shout out to the one for the help. Was able to knock this thing out pretty quickly. So, uh, you know, you guys enjoy. If you got any questions, just ask. And hit the bell so you know when I put up a video. Hit the like button for me, and I'll see y'all in the next one, guys. Peace.